Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to briefly explain what HTML is and show you how you can create your first web page and add picture to your web page. HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language. HTML is the standard markup language for creating web pages. The tool also describes the structure of a web page. It consists of a series of elements, and these elements tell the browser how to display the content. I had created the folder and downloaded the image that I want to insert to my web page inside my folder. I will create a new text document file and change the file format from TXT to HTML so that it becomes our web page and we are able to open the page on different browsers. Now once you are done changing the file format, press enter and click OK to agree to save the changes. Now we have our HTML page. Let's open the page and see how it looks like on the browser. As you can see, we have a blank page because we are yet to write anything. Now let's go to our Visual Studio code and open a new window. On the start, click on Open Folder. Then I will go to the location where I had created the folder, which contains the lion image and our HTML page. Once you have found your folder, click on Select and the folder will automatically open on the Visual Studio Code. Double-click on the HTML file to start writing some contents. First, let's type the document type declaration known as Doctype. The Doctype declaration is an instruction to the web browser about what version of HTML the page is written in. Let's write the lang attribute that specifies the language of the element's content. We will use N for English. Then we have to write the head tag. This is an HTML element used to define the head section of an HTML document. The head section contains metadata, which simply means data about data. We write the title tag in between the head tag. This defines the title of the document, and it is shown in the browser's title bar, or in the Pages tab. Now let's give our page the title. Then we open our web page and see if it is appearing. Now the title is showing on our page. Now it's time to insert our image on our web page. The M tag has to required attributes. SRC specifies the path to the image. Alta specifies an alternate text for the image if the image for some reason cannot be displayed. Then let's check our image on the web page. Refresh your page in order to see your new changes. Now our image is there on our page. There are more we can do on this image. We can increase the size of the image. Let's do that. Let's add the width and the height we want. For the width, let's put 600 pixels. And for the height, let's put 500 pixels. Save and go back to the web page. Again, we need to refresh the to see the changes. Now the image has increased in size and can be seen properly. That is it for today's video. Subscribe, like, share and let us know on the comment if the video was helpful. Thank you for watching. See you again.